what if I told you that the shutdown feature in Windows doesn't actually shut down? In fact, what it's more doing is a mix between shutdown and hibernate. Hibernate's an old feature that Windows used to have alongside these options down here. And as of Windows 8, Microsoft added a feature to Windows called Fast Startup. Let's take a look. I'll have this article in the description. It's talking about delivering a great startup and shutdown experience. But the main part I wanted to bring to your attention is in the middle of the page here, or at least further down the page. Starting with Windows 8, the default shutdown and restart scenario have been updated and named Fast Startup. So the gist is it's actually saving part of the state of Windows to the disk so that when you go to boot next time, it doesn't have to come up with everything from scratch. It just loads part of it from memory. That's not exactly shutting down, but it's nice that they found a way to speed up the boot process in Windows. The downside though, is that if you're looking to fix a problem in Windows, let's say you notice something strange that's going on and you wanna try the old turn it off and on again trick, which is a really good trick. What you should know is that shutting down does not actually turn it off. So it really depends what you're trying to do. If you're trying to solve a problem, something weird that's happening in Windows, try restart. But if you're going to step away from your computer and you want to power it off, uh, just do a shutdown. That's perfect because the next time you go to power the thing on, it's going to power on faster. So that's just a little trick for you guys because I got fooled a couple times until I realized this, that Microsoft had merged shutdown and hibernate into one. 